figured it out. Persuasion thing. It's this. It's the books are leading me from choice to choice and I have to decide for myself. So I stopped reading Persuasion. And I'm not gonna finish it. I need to make a decision for myself about what it is I want. And I want to stop dating Adam. So I'm not gonna do that anymore. I don't know if that is what happens in the book. But based on the last chapter that I read, I kind of suspect that Anne does the same thing with Mr. Elliot. I also want to keep trying to get my work published on my own. You know, I, I got over that submission hurdle and I'm not afraid of it anymore. And so it's time to keep pushing. I also need to decide if if I want things to go back to how they were with Andrew and I need to do that independently of the book and I do I do want that I miss my friend Andrew. It's so much easier for me to write what I want to say. It always has been. I have no idea if you even still care. I don't know. But I miss my friend. my best friend. I was afraid that if we were happy and everything in the world was easy, I wouldn't have any creative spark, but I hope, I hope that's not true. You're half of me. You're the half that keeps me calm. The half that's spontaneous. I do need to be distracted, and I want you to be the one who does that. We are so different, but I think now that's better. I'm attached to you. You've been my best friend, and I know what persuasion was teaching me. And I'm here. <laughs>